Hey, my Capricorns. I'm trying to set up, like, um, my camera on my new laptop. And you may not see me like that because I got it kind of, like, blocked. Not because of nothing bad. It's just because, like, I'm trying to, like, get things together. And I literally was not on YouTube for is a computer like a laptop or a personal desk computer for like Christmas and I like just working on my phone but it's better like if you get into a computer because you get to see what's going on more on your page and things you might like I was missing out with some things that could have been updated maybe six months ago got some type of offers where people want me to be on their channel they want to promote things and i was inactive whereas though i wasn't getting the messages through youtube so they might have went to somebody else but a couple of them still want me so that was good you feel what i'm saying but capricorn i literally just told somebody like I may be going away and I'm not fucking with the past at all. Well, one of the reasons is like I just don't trust it and there's like so much stuff going on right now in my energy. I just don't like it's good energy around me but I got a lot of haters which they like back the fuck off and I just I want to try with this new person that that came into my life like this person works in a fraud department um at a job that deal with fake money scams all that and like they jamaican like i don't know me and foreigners like click like that's just probably what it is and me as myself like half foreigner like my son dad have jamaican as well trinidad so at the end of the day like this is just what it is like and we haven't really got to kick it because he work a lot i'm working a lot like even though i'm working from home i work a lot and then i still got my office and i'm trying to like blow that up and do a lot of things you feel what i'm saying that that's to do with a lot of money it's just a lot going on like far as my pinnacle so i don't really know how time for nobody else and i'm just so happy so many people are in my life like, I, I can't even express how much I'm so happy people are in my life. Like, really, Capricorn, for real. Like, it's it's like a peaceful situation when you just don't fuck with nobody. You feel what I'm saying? You don't even wave to nobody. You don't even acknowledge them. You know, a lot of people lost a good friend, such as myself. And that's just on them. They, they put that situation on ourselves. You feel me, um, Capricorn? But either here or there... I got like six devices right now in front of me. I be mean, I'm working on a lot of shit. Like I know you, if y'all see this, she's like, damn, four phones, seven cameras, and she's trying to do this and that. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm literally a boss, bitch. Like I like to work, and I am trying to work at um the place where people hated it. and I kind of hate it too. But is um the people that give me parking tickets. I am trying to get a job there, and I'm also trying to get a job at the hospital as a receptionist. I want to be the one to give you your tickets to go upstairs, or I'm looking up names for you so you can call your loved ones. Bottom fucking line. Like, I, why? I'll keep the rest to myself, but I have reasons why I'm trying to do what I'm trying to do. Now, I'm not going to overwork myself because I'm already doing a lot, and I don't want to cut back on my YouTube by working too much, but... I could throw in the extra 40 hours or 60 hours with what I'm doing. I'll be fine. You feel what I'm saying? So that's what I'm trying to do right now. You feel what I'm saying? Stay on positive energy, even though negative energy come come around you no matter what. But I just kick that shit to the curb. But here and there, Capricorns, the energy I'm getting is change your Wi-Fi password, password right the fuck now. And that was coming on me when I was like fixing up a lot of stuff. So I'm saying change your Wi-Fi password right the fuck now. So I don't know if somebody's trying to break into your Wi-Fi password. And I'm not sure if it's your home, your cell, your hotspot, whatever you got going on. You should change your Wi-Fi name and Wi-Fi password. If you don't know how to do it, all you got to do is Google it. It's real easy. If you have Fizos, 
I could just tell you the steps right now. If you don't have the Faisal app downloaded, download Faisal's app. You go into your settings and it's going to have your Wi-Fi password and all that when you go into that and just change it. Hit the X, change it to what you want, save it, it's going to update and you just got to update all your devices. Change your name and Wi-Fi password. I don't know why that came to me and when it came to me, I immediately changed all my codes. Automatic. I don't have people in here, but people just tend to be slick. Don't change it to like your grandbaby name, your kid's name, your birth date, none of that shit. Think of some shit and make sure you don't forget it. If you do, make sure you be able to, you could just reboot your whole router and then it'll go back to the original settings if it's your house. If it's your phone, you know that shit easy. And if it's like emails and all that, just always keep your phone number updated. Or have a backup email so you could get stuff sent there. You feel what I'm saying, Capricorn? So this is going to be like the last, last reading for the night. Because I'm literally like about to like go to sleep. I'm tired. I have to take my car tomorrow. If not, he said Tuesday. I'm fine with Tuesday. I'm chilling. I got a, I got a date. Yeah, I got a date. Yeah, I got a date. Um, Everybody hitting me up asking me what am I going to do about the situation I'm dealing with. Listen. I'll let y'all know after I go to Ocean City, Maryland. Crack the fuck up. I'm moving forward and I keep it real with anybody I deal with. And honestly, I'm not sure what I want to do. But I can't have no bum in my life for the 18 years. And I'm not saying that because I'm beefing with the person. Because I'm not really beefing with them. But all the little secrets that came out, even though they think nobody says nothing about them, everybody is for them. No. I was warned, don't fuck with them. Well, don't fuck with that person anyway. They a bum. Like, you could do way better than that. I just don't want you to do that. And, like, pill head, all type of stuff. I didn't see. I guess they know. You feel what I'm saying? And just the way that they carry themselves and their parenting skills, I don't like. So... I'm like, mm, mm So, it's just like, I'm ready to move forward, like, with a new life, a new beginning. And I may go through something, you know, but everything turns out for the best. You feel me? So, you're not going to see the cards, but, oh my God, Capricorn, we having a passion. Money came out slow here. And with the three of pentacles, you making a name for yourself. You building up something. You making your name. You could be famous in your own way or you building to fame. Famous people could be helping you in some type of way. You don't even know it. With the wheel of fortune, good luck is on your side, Capricorn. Bottom fucking line um, is what I'm seeing. So, yeah, I see that you balance, Capricorn. You're coming up out of dealing with something that hurts you, hurt you, stabbed you in your back. I'm seeing you coming up out of devilish energy. Stop dealing with people. Like you just you just bossing Capricorn at this time and winter time is always our time. Well my time been all for the last couple of years. Like I deserve it. But Capricorn, I see you giving and taking equally. I see that like you're coming up out of having one wand that makes something happen. This could be a Sagittarius in your energy, Capricorn in your energy, air in your energy. That's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing you had a felt victory in something in your situation or Somebody may have a fell victory with you. They plotting on some shit because you're happy here. I'm seeing you could be dealing with a water sign, an air sign, or a fire sign. I'm definitely seeing this in your energy. Yeah, I see somebody's under heavy, heavy, heavy anxiety here. Yeah, you're coming up out of having patience and stress for somebody. You could be dealing with an air sign here. Yeah, you're cutting somebody off here. Could be an air sign. You get in truth, like the divine is handing you the sword with the ace of swords, Kathy. It's just like you, 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 you can't go backwards. You're like, I can't, I can't do this. It's like you can't do this. Like, like somebody trying to make something happen towards you slow, but it's like you not having it. Like it's like you being arrogant. You know this person gossiping, hating on you, lying on you anyway. You could be dealing with an air sign. Don't have to be. You come up out of having patience for this person. And this person is stalking you. You could be dealing with a water sign. Somebody is stalking you really bad, Capricorn here. Yeah, you just you just want to stay to yourself, keep your business to yourself, your money to yourself. You're coming up out of dealing with liars. You're going in a different direction. You the ten of pentacles. You don't got time 
for this. And you and you may be dealing with somebody that's a ten of pentacles here. It's not a new beginning if you go backwards, Capricorn. Like for real. Like mm -mm. you going in another direction. You 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 could have this you could have been dealing with a Virgo. It's a lot of confusion around you. Like far as you trying to figure out what to choose here. You could be dealing with a water sign or they're confused. Yeah, you're not moving toward this situation. Somebody gonna be trying to gas like Gas like to manipulate you anyway. You know what I mean? But you're going to take a chance elsewhere, Capricorn. You're like, I'm not fucking. Yeah, with the Ace of Cups, you, you're going to get a new love. It's a new love on the horizon. You got to give a chance to. Yeah, you got a lot of fake motherfuckers around you. Like, they fake as fuck. Yeah. Somebody got a couple of bullshit here. You're coming up out of not knowing which way to go. You could be dealing with a water sign or an air sign. Yeah, you not budging. You like, nah, I'm good. Yeah, they trying to come towards you here, make something happen. Well, this is you making shit happen. They're not happy, really. They're not really working to their fullest of potential here. You be dealing with an earth sign or a fire sign. You just opening your eyes, Capricorn. Yeah, you're coming up out of dealing with confusion here. You like, mm-mm. I'm met he, I'm the met to be here. I'm here for a purpose. Other motherfuckers is just here, just a waste of a life. Yeah. Somebody's just looking at your money here, grow, and they there is not growing. Yeah, somebody is just bad news. A fire sign energy. There's a judgment against somebody here. You're closing cycles with this person anyway. Or you already did. Yeah, a tower moment. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Like this is crazy because I just did a reading. What is the energy? Yeah, somebody's ships ain't coming in. You left somebody in the cold. You could have been dealing with a cancer. Somebody not to be trusted. They're trying to offer you something. They're not to be trusted. Cancer energy. Secrets came out. And with the King of Pentacles, Capricorn, you, you bossing. So you like, I don't want no pages. I don't want no nights. Yeah, somebody's stressing about losing you. You could be dealing with a water sign. Yeah, it was too many ups and downs to be continuing something here. Yeah, you definitely could be dealing with a water sign or a cancer here. It's like, mm-mm. Let them, yeah, you cut them off here. You could be, yeah, you, you, you spiritual. You got a new beginning and some creative projects. Somebody don't want to leave the past behind. They want to live in lies. Yeah, Capricorn, this could be you. I hope not. Don't do it. With the hangman, you could be stuck in a situation. You can't make something happen here. Or somebody else can. With the justice here, you're getting justice for something with the four wands. You're going to get everything you want. Just be patient. Yeah. Somebody don't have a whole world in their hand. And you're not giving somebody some emotion here. You're like, I'm not doing that. The nine of pentacles, you comfortable here. Some secrets may came out about something. You're coming up out of dealing with snakes here. Somebody to act young here. You could be dealing with an earth sign. You could be dealing... For the air sign, yeah, to the star, that Aquarius energy. You definitely get everything that you wish and hope for, Capricorn. Bottom fucking line. Like this energy here, Capricorn, is literally telling you, keep it fucking pushing. And this could be for somebody that resonates with the three of cups. Yeah. You will be celebrating soon. This could be a marriage here. Like, yeah, you just cutting them all fast, quick, and nasty. Yeah. You coming up out of third parties and people lying. You don't feel like dealing with that. Could be done with an air sign. Don't have to be. You just at a point in your life where you like, man, listen, hi and bye. Yeah, they unhappy in their life. They got family problems. Why they probably coming around with the emperor? You like fuck out of here. You 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 not trying to hear nothing nobody saying. Like different people coming at you, and it's like you not even giving them no energy no more at all. You like fuck all, fuck off. Yeah, some people got a lot of shit on their back. They carrying. They want to come to you with some shit. You be dealing with Sagittarius, a fire sign. Yeah, you turning your back with the Eight of Cups. What's your emotions attack? Water sign energy. You can be turning your back on them as well. Yeah, you coming up out of making decisions in your love life. You just letting shit go how it go. You be dealing with a Gemini. Yeah, you may wasn't using your intuition in the past. Bottom line here, you're coming up out of being stuck in situation and your past is trying to come back in your life here. I don't see you going backwards though. I see they want to offer you something, but Capricorn, they're a past for a fucking reason. And I had to realize that for a minute, especially if I did that reading. I ain't fucking around because you ain't fucking up my good shit going on. Winter time, me and my son, we be chilling in the winter. Winter time, we really be having fun the winter time. Like we have fun summer, but the winter time, our birthdays, for some reason, we just be bossing up. I don't know what it be, but and he is Sagittarius, but my son is a December Sagittarius. And the all them the them November ones I don't know about, but the December, December second, 
they really be bossing, and that's it, and they stay what they need to do, like, they don't have all niggas hanging around them, all that, like, nah, ain't none of that, when he was younger, younger, yeah, but I raised them niggas my son used to hang with, and I, like, they family, basically, even if my son don't speak to all of them, they family, like, this five, six years old, y'all in my house, and y'all about to hit 30, that's the difference, but hang with a bunch of clowns, that don't do nothing but count bitches they sleeping with and don't have nowhere really to stay or they don't have nothing really to do with their life and they just swinging stuff all around these young boys nowadays i don't know what what cloth they built from i'm glad man Ooh, i'm glad i don't got one of them misery love company yeah you may be having somebody that's just miserable and want to be in your energy domestic situations somebody may be in domestic situations as well and you don't really know shit happens here we also got karma is a bitch somebody's coming up out of having karma here too that was reversed here masturbating energy somebody may be masturbating thinking about you masculine feminine energy capricorn you feel what i'm saying arrogant aries you could be dealing with an aries here and pure devil energy is the last card capricorn energy but capricorn somebody is just under pure devil energy is why they try to be around you so now you know i know change that wi-fi password i didn't order me new cards for the season like i have like i think nine morgan greer decks every season i change a lot of my cards i got over like 300 different decks of cards some never even open um i got something called um queer terry um, it's for like a lot of bisexual gay men and stuff. Uh, one of the uh, terror people I listened to put me on, so I Googled it. I got it. And something else is coming because people act like they don't want to tell you their cards. Like I do too sometimes because it don't matter if you tell them what cards you got or not. If they're not in the same energy, they're not giving you the same read. And you got a lot of uh, corny motherfuckers that like uh other tarot readers that don't want to tell you like you'll send them a message they act like they too good to respond like first of all you're buying your views you buying your likes you buying your comments it's like calm down you're not really partnering google or youtube because they know all the slick stuff so like instead of them being like oh okay this is the name of the cards they'll be on something corny so like um i don't really deal with them it's a couple i listen to and like I used to have my comments off because people is so rude and they always got something negative to say. But I know how to tune that out because out of all the negativity, others will come at you and they be like, "Oh, you bet you highlight my comments so they could come at me." No, they coming at you because you want that you're negative on my page. They don't understand why you here, and if you don't like something, you could just click off. So they gonna come at you on my page and most of the time I don't have to say nothing. It's like somebody else will come at them or they'll put something positive or like just keep it moving or even worry about them. So I, I give a shout out to all my subscriber my subscribers, you know, that's looking out for me and for all y'all that's checking me out. I did just update my bio section in YouTube. I took down things I don't use no more as far as PayPal. Cash app is all updated um i also updated my instagram i changed my instagram name yes i did i changed that today i changed my bio on instagram um it's a new season it's a new me that's just how i be every season i change up everything and i just feel good vibes around me and good vibes and good things happening for me and my capricorn seasons um for everybody um that kn that know that i had weight loss surgery because i was short and to me i was overweight even though people said i really wasn't some people was like i was okay but people that know me know that i gained weight so i had the surgery and i was like a hundred and basically 25 pounds overweight i am down 98 pounds now um from my goal weight and i only have 40 more pounds left to lose that i want to lose and i'm good you feel what i'm saying i'm going to get myself snatched up and that's just the fuck it you feel what i'm saying um and i still exercise do my gym and i do things at home um so that's a good big congratulations i lost 100 pounds since january the 6th that's a lot or was it the fifth i went in y'all follow me y'all know and i appreciate all my followers you know that looked out for me you know i i still appreciate the dollar donations to my trauma center um for my children i am open a trauma center for children that's victim of some type of um really sexual assault but any type of crime 
um, that's documented. I want to open a recreation center with pools and stuff. It's been hard in the state I'm in because it's like so much crime here that I'm deterred to open anything here. I wanted to open centers all over the world and I'm looking to backtrack toward Delaware. Um, there's no taxes and it's like more better there in a part of Delaware I was. I wasn't never living in a hood. I never lived in a hood at all with my children. They was moved they was they was raised in the suburbs all the way up. Period. Um, even I. I moved out of the hood. It wasn't even that bad then at twenty one and had my own place ever since. And I'm in my forties, early forties. A lot of people can't do that or still live at home. So like I just appreciate y'all comments, you know, and I got a lot of negativity that lives around me, you know, little haters here and there, and I don't even fuck with these people. I don't really know these people. I tried to be nice to them, but I had to cut everybody off because they frauds. You feel what I'm saying? And at this process, I'm trying to do a lot of stuff because I do want to make that step to move forward and move out. You feel what I'm saying? It's no rush. Um, I did get a new ADT alarm, whereas though I had to get my shit directly, take pictures, and it just go where I need to go because it was just too much stuff going on. And like everyone want to be in the camera, will be in the camera at the police district. And if you're doing anything legal, you want camera, and that's just dumb. And I just feel as though I'm done with any type of little disrespect because I do, you know, have family and I do got, you know, a son too, but you know, don't get it fucked up. And I got a daughter, like my daughter, I know, like, I hate to say it, but I know a lot of people cannot be hand work with my daughter. She's really dealing, knocking grown women out. Like I just be in my energy. Like, do I gotta bring her out here for a week? Like go sit down somewhere because I know for a fact y'all can't handle her. She don't fight like a girl. Like, that's not happening. She knocks me down. So, I just, like, stay away from the, the rodents and the peasants. You know what I mean? Because I know they negative energy and they talk too much instead of focusing on their life and how they could deal and be better and show their kids a better way. You feel me? Try to get their own shit and move forward in their life. You feel me, Caps? But, yeah, I'm going to end this note on, you know what I mean? I appreciate everything, yo, because at the end of the day, my YouTube wouldn't be what it is without you. And, like, I'm trying to hit that 10,000K. You feel what I'm saying? That's a real accomplishment for me. It took me a long time. I've been on YouTube since 2017, yo. Yo, and, like, I tell anybody, you may start off with just five fucking subscribers, but you don't know what overnight could bring you. You just got to keep it pushing. You might be like, oh, my God, it been five subscribers for a month. I'm done. Yo, don't give up your dreams. Your dreams is the only thing you have in this fucking world. Peace.